Hello fellow YouTubers and once it's scale figure collectors this is Lycan of the Underworld here again um, this is a video I said I was going to do it's my custom Alice figure from the third movie in the Resident Evil series uh, Resident Evil Extinction just going to let you know what bits I used and where I got them from basically all the bits that I got I bought from eBay um, it took me probably about a month or so to get all the bits together and quite a bit of money to get this figure as I wanted it I've gone a bit OTT with the weapons as you can see but then when you're fighting zombies the more the better so this is what I used the head sculpt and the body are from the Hot Toys Resident Evil Alice figure um, all the clothing, that's the coat, the scarf the shorts, the t-shirt, the waistcoat she's got and the boots and the gun holsters as well they all come from Brother Productions Zombie Killer figure which is a great figure but it's just not up to the par of Hot Toys the batons she's got there the machine guns, the two machine guns that she's got the um, pistols that I've got here in the coat the shotguns there sorry um, I've got one either side inside the jacket here you've got the uh, let's just let it focus you've got the magnum pistols either side they're all from Hot Toys Alice figure the camcorder I believe is from a side girl figure if you just go on eBay go on type in camcorder and go on toys and games um, there should be one on there somewhere that was only about two dollar like that the crossbow and the crow bolts are from Sideshow's G.I. Joe range and it's from the beachhead version um, it's just pure luck that I managed to get that I don't think you'll find many of them on eBay because um, that is a very sought after figure and people will not be selling it it's just pure luck to say that I got that um, round at the back uh, the shotgun is from the Chris Redfield BSA version uh, by Hot Toys and the shotgun sheath you got there is from the Brothers Production zombie killer figure um, underneath the jacket um, there you've got uh, two Gherkin knives there from the Hot Toys Alice figure the jacket, as I say, is from the Brothers Production Zombie Killer figure. It's got down all the linings here is uh, a wire, so you can actually pose the coat exactly how you want it. So it looks like it's blowing in the breeze, sort of thing. Um, what have I missed? Oh yeah, down on her leg here, you've got the hunting knife and the sheath. That's from the Hot Toys. Um, Major Allen Dutch figure, the Arnold Schwarzenegger figure from Predator 1. I'll put that on there. Um, I believe the last thing that I've used is these goggles. They came from um, a Desert Marine sideshow. It's one of the sideshow figures. Desert Marine figure. It's not exactly accurate, but I only picked it out because the colour matches matches the suit. The hands, they're from the Brothers Production figure. They're not very good hands, they don't really stay on there very well. Um, but they do the job. As I say, I don't know how much this cost me to get it all done. Uh, you're probably looking at about $150 to $200 all, you know, for the whole lot. The head sculpt and the body was the most expensive part. Um, Sorry about the camera work, as I'm sort of doing this off the hip sort of thing. So I'm making it up as I go along. And the stand is the obviously the Hot Toys figure, Alice figure. Um, you may have noticed that the last few videos I've had my figure standing on the Hot Toys Predator 2 Battle Damage box. Uh, just to let you know that I have got this actual figure. It's in here. 
It's all 100% complete. It's up for sale on eBay. I think I've got it up for £265. Um, if you're interested, it is still there at the moment. Um, and the date is the 22nd of May. So it's still on there. Um, if you want to find it, my username on there is Daz3017. I'll put it in the description underneath this video. Um, so if you're quick and you want it, it's there. Um, I'm getting rid of it because, as you all know, the new Predator 2 figure is coming out at the end of the year by Hot Toys. And I prefer the newer bodies to the older bodies. So that is why I'm selling that figure. Um, I will be doing more videos. I've got videos on Predators and superheroes and a few other things. Uh, figures that is, Hot Toys figures. And I've got loads of figures on order. And as they come through, I will do videos on them. Um, as I said in my other videos, I won't review them. Because my opinions don't matter, really. And other people are already going to be reviewing them. There's hundreds of people on there who are better at it than me. Like um, P2, MRA, uh, Clipper King, Moggy215, and a few others out there. Do some really good reviews. Sean Long another one. Um, so if you want to get reviews on these figures, check those guys out because they do a superb job and their video quality is brilliant. Their production values they use on their videos is very good. So yeah, I'm just using a handheld mobile phone, um, making things up as I go along. Uh, so the next set of video that I will do will probably be some of the Predators. I haven't decided yet. I've got the black Spider-Man on the way, so it could be black Spider-Man and the red and blue suited Spider-Man. But um, I won't be doing any more videos until the weekend. Um, so until then, hope you enjoy the videos that I've already done. Again, sorry for the camera work. I'm no pro. And uh, feel free to leave comments. Peace out.